in midair. Severe turbulence walloping a passenger jet on a transatlantic flight. And ABC's David Curley has all the latest from Washington. Good morning, David. George, some frightening moments. That warning we hear often when we are in your seat, buckle your seatbelt. Well, passengers on that flight from New York to Dublin found out what can happen very suddenly when their jet was hit by severe turbulence. We hit a pretty bad downdraft and we have some passengers hurt, so we need uh, some ambulance to meet the flight. This morning, we're hearing the dramatic moments from the cockpit of United Flight 23 as the plane full of people tossed around by a huge downdraft Sunday on its descent into Dublin. We would like to have uh, uh, the truck standing by. By truck, he means ambulance. United says the seatbelt light was on for the 129 passengers from Newark, but some were still injured. United 2, 3, uh, do you reckon one or more ambulances you need? Oh, it could be uh, as many as six or so people, so it might be uh, a couple ambulances. We've seen on other flights what can happen when unstable air violently shakes an aircraft, like this NASA video, and on this JetBlue flight over New York. As for Sunday's United flight, the injured passengers weren't the only problem. The pilots also told air traffic control that they were getting warning signals about trouble with their aircraft. You had a two, three, uh, are any of those uh, people hurt? Are they seriously hurt? Right now, we're not really sure because we're uh, still working on the hydraulic problem. The good news, the jet landed safely in Dublin, even with that hydraulic problem. Turns out only one passenger was taken to the hospital and was released. Seven other passengers treated at the airport. Another reminder of how unpredictable these turbulences can be when you're in flight. George?